What kind of network audio streamer can you buy for 300 bucks, US dollars, euros, bucks, whatever? Well, you can buy a Sonos Connect. This is actually the wired for sound modified version, but the analog output is unchanged from the stock version of this. So if I was to hook this up to my Hegel amplifier, I would hear how a Sonos Connect sounds. And the analog output, mm, not great. There are many things that are better. I've made a video about that already. Today I want to tell you about one other thing that's better. And this cable, which is connected to the Hager lamp, gives us a clue as to what it is, because you can tell three and a half mil. This isn't your average network streamer. This network streamer also has a screen. Think about this. How many $300 network streamers do you know of that have a display screen for cover art and things like that? This is the LG V30 smartphone. LG put a decent headphone output chip in this. They put a decent DAC in this. It sounds way better than the iPhone and many other smartphones. But we can also deploy it as a network streamer to give us some very, very satisfactory results. So I can take my 3.5mm output. I can plug it on there, get a stand for it, put it there, and there we have a $300 network streamer. Now you're probably thinking right now, he's running Rune. How can this possibly work? Well, you might be right because a phone automatically starts off, if you launch the, the Rune remote app, it starts off as a private zone. But if we go into the settings and disengage the privacy of that zone, it then becomes available to us with another the smartphone. I can then control Rune on my LG V30 down here with this LG 40 up here. So once we've connected the LG to our amplifier, we need to ramp up the volume to 100% so we're getting effectively line level out of it. And now that's running and now I can use my LG V40 or any other smartphone, click play and it will engage play on this. I can click play pause here, but I can also click play pause on here. So I'm going to pause, play. I'm doing it quickly so I don't get busted by the copyright police on YouTube. So this is my full display network streamer. You can buy the LG V30 still in Germany it sells for 300 euros and you could probably get it for a similar price around the world. You can get the LG V40 for a bit more. I think this one was 500 euros. And again, it's a great sounding streamer and it's definitely better sounding than the Sonos Connect. Miles better. This is a fantastic sounding phone. It has a good DAC, good headphone output and therefore it's a good streamer. Now it's not just Rune that we can do this for, we can also do this for Spotify. So if we go back to our phone here, pull up Spotify, here's some orbital, I'll click shuffle play on that. Now that will come out of my amp, but if I go to Spotify on here and go to devices available, see look, LG V30 continue, so you click on continue. This is the remote control, Spotify. This is the Spotify player.
So with both Rune and Spotify, this LG phone can work as a network streamer and a very, very good sounding network streamer. I think this is a, a pretty cool little way to redeploy a phone that I don't use as a phone anymore and connect it to my Wi-Fi network. Bump up the volume again. Click play. And because this is an LG V-series phone, it does MQA natively. Although I'm playing some Sisters of Mercy here, streamed MQA from Tidal in Rune, and Rune says there's a bit depth conversion going on from 24-bit to 16-bit. Don't know why that says that. Anyway, so there is MQA capabilities here, but I wouldn't get hung up on that. I think this is a great streamer. It's a neat trick, and we get cover art display. So I think that's pretty cool. If you think that's cool as well, please give us a like down below. And if you like short little videos like this about, I won't call this a hack. It's not a hack. It's just redeploying a phone in a different way. If you like this kind of thing, please consider subscribing to this channel. Extra information can be found in the description box. Please look at the description box. And as always, thank you so much for watching.